Hello friends, welcome to Technical Etudian. So today in this video we are going to see different methods to import data in MATLAB software. So I am opening my MATLAB and in the MATLAB you are able to see one icon at the top showing import. Presently I am considering my previous data set of my video that is my machine learning data set and you are able to see here two options in insert type showing the complete data set import and only the columns import and you are able to see all the data that I have imported in the workspace ok so there are two ways I am presently considering my code this is a simple basic code I am simply just doing necessary changes in it so in the x-axis I considered my values of my x-axis parameter from the workspace. You just need to see what I am doing in the video. And in similarly in the y-axis or in the y1 we, you just need to put the y-axis values. And do the necessary changes like changing the x label as my number of neighbors and my y label as my r square values and giving the legions as my testing data so this is how you need to do the certain changes once you are done you are able to see the graph i get you can uh, simply save the code and run it on the top there is one icon or you can just co or copy it and paste it in the command window then also you can get the similar graph just change the resolution of this graph by going into the file section in the export setup and change the access property of this graph like changing its style font size and removing the minor grid lines so once you are done just copy it into the manuscript or the word file so this is the first way and in the second way you are not requiring you does not require this x y values as you have data in your workspace so in that case you just need to write the command remove this x or y values just write plot x comma y1 is there so in this x you just need to mention the names that is showing in the workspace that is our x axis parameter and on the y you write y axis parameter and rest all things will be same just copy it into the command window and run it you will get the graph and simply do the necessary changes like changing the font size or changing the resolution and once you are done just copy the figure into the word file or into the manuscript and if you need any other information related to this i will mention the code in the description box and you can also contact me on the instagram handle and my gmail id thanks for watching like share and subscribe